party. But of course, uh, he didn't spare uh, his chief opponent, which is the ANC, saying to ANC, the EFF is indeed coming and it's going to be a force to be reckoned with. And they are focusing on nothing other than dethroning um, the 101-year-old political party. Well, whether, of course, he's going to succeed and how, of course, he's going to do that is what they say um, they are working on right now. Mm -hmm. But uh, joining me now um, is the party's national uh, spokesperson. I just want to get a sense from him on whether, in fact, how happy they are about the proceedings and, in fact, where to from now. Things went well, according to you? Yes, yes, they went extremely well. In fact, fantabulous. Is it what you expected, the turnout that is? Yes, we did. Our people came in numbers. It's, uh, it's overwhelming, extremely overwhelming, and even if you might have expected it. But seeing it in numbers, actually, you know, getting there with warm bodies is extremely humbling. So indeed, it is what we expected. Now, where were the people we saw here drawn from? Mostly from the northwest. Uh, we had 100 trips that were made from across the province. Well, not all of the province. Uh, we didn't have buses from as far as Uppington. We didn't have buses from uh, Freiburg. We had mostly people from the surrounding towns of Rustenburg. And we've had a couple of people from across the country, but there were very few. So the majority of the people that we saw here are really the community uh, from Marikana and the surrounding uh, townships. A well-organized uh, event for a party that is uh, pleading poverty, one would say. Well, as the president said, this is a giant that was birthed on its feet. And so it's a baby that was born and then shakes your hand. Um, it is precisely because the conditions have changed on the ground. Our people are ready for change and they are embracing the message of the economic freedom fighters. And I think that uh, going forward, we're going to see much more support. And it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a demonstration that the elections next year are going to be decisive on our part. Well, Julius Malema says uh, he's focusing on being president and nothing less. You're focusing on being, uh, you are in government in waiting, as you called yourselves here today. But how realistic really is that? Well, we have faith. We believe in our people. We believe our people will show up in great numbers and translate the 20 years that the African National Congress aggression has shown on them, that they will come and take it out and give a new page to a new radical economic framework, which actually promises to bring back land to them, to bring back the mines and all the minerals into their hands, to bring them real opportunities and to conclude for the final analysis and the final analysis to completely de-racialize the colonial patterns uh, 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 of property ownership. So and that's the message I think that uh, that is why we think it's realistic is because it's really time. It's 20 years later it's time for a new party, for a new message, for a new experimentation with radical economic policy. Now with a court case pending have you as the leadership of the organization sat down and look at sort of various possibilities that you may have in the event something happens that you may not be expecting as things said. Well, we are convinced nothing is going to happen. President uh, is going to be inaugurated in Pretoria. Uh, the, the case is a conspiracy of the intimidated, self-hating African National Congress trying to suppress a time whose idea has come. So they are not going to suppress it. Even if they would, uh, they would kill, which will not happen. Uh, even if they would be in prison, which will not happen. The ideas of the economic freedom fighters are out there, and our people are going to be decisive nonetheless in the next elections, and EFF is going to be the next government. Thank you very much. Well, we send in Lozi, the national spokesperson uh, of the EFF, talking there about how happy they are, about how things went, but of course not oblivious to the task ahead, which is an enormous task to dethrone the African National Congress, the biggest political party in the land and the oldest in the, on the African continent. It's back to the studio.